Hello everyone. So this video is going to be a bit of an experiment because I am outside, but I'm going to be doing a sounds video. So I have some outside things that I'm going to be making sounds with, but then you'll also have the sounds of the breeze, the birds, um, some wind chimes I know you'll probably hear. And so hopefully the whole combination will be very relaxing for you. So, a little test. I do have my gorgeous but very big blue headphones on. Um, I actually have them plugged into my mic so I can hear how um, everything is sounding. <laughs> so, there may be um, pauses in this video. Um, if something loud happens outside, I can't completely control the environment, but um, it'll just flow on to the next portion of the video, so it shouldn't um, disturb you or anything. So, I'll just start off with some small things, and I just have some rocks here. Is almost like a purple. It's got a gray purple tint to it. And then this one is just a normal rock. Doesn't really have any special colors to it or anything. And before anybody else mentions it, you're probably going to be able to see the upper part of my tattoo in this video, just like the makeup one. Yes, it is there. I am aware. <laughs> There's those ones. I'll try to gently set it down so it doesn't get too loud. This one is just like a gray as well, but it has some different holes in it. Um, I don't know what the word is I'm looking for. It almost looks a little bit more like fossilized, if that makes any sense. So there's that one. And then this one is very white, with little bits of beige in it, but it's mostly the white color. And it's a lot smoother than the other ones. And it has a different shape than the other ones did. It's very long. But because it's so smooth, um, the sounds are pretty nice with it and a little bit more gentle. Just tapping from side to side. Alright, so um, keeping with the smaller items, I just have um, some clothespins.
some of the wood is nice as well. I always thought when I was younger that these looked like crocodiles. Is that just me? Probably. So now, um, see I have two medium sized items and then I have two bigger ones, so I guess I'll just change it up and do, and do um, one of the bigger ones of this. I don't, I don't even know if I'll get it in shot. Is a watering can, a plastic one. and I thought that it would make some really nice sounds for it. And if anyone comments saying this stuff is dirty, well, no duh, it's stuff from outside. <laughs> So this is a two gallon bucket and it has the numbers counted on the side, one liter, two liter, three liter, four liter, five liter, six liter, seven liter, that's what's on the side. I like the way that this handle sounds. There's one, two, three, four, five down, and one, two, three, four, six, seven across. So there's 35 of these little dots right here. I'm assuming it's the same. Right, so I'll grab 
decisions, decisions. This is one of the medium sized ones and it's it's one of the um My nails have grown out a little bit since I had to take my um, other na my long nails off, so I'm able to tap a little bit better on things when they're a little bit stronger. I do so. There's ridges in the plastic part right here. So if I just spin it around my fingers, you can probably hear it hitting the ridges. Right. So there is that. So this one is probably going to scare some people, but I was searching outside for different things to make sounds with, and I found these, and they actually make a really good sound, I think. So I will look like Edward Scissorhands right here, but... I really like the sound of these ones. And don't worry, I'm not going to cut your ear off. I promise. Perhaps we'll have to do that in a parody video. I just really like the sound of them. That didn't scare you too bad. <laughs> okay, so now the last thing that I have is the biggest one, but I think it's really pretty, and I thought that it might make some nice sounds for this, so I'll go ahead and grab it. It is this. It's a butterfly. <laughs> and I really like it. Oops. As you can see, it's made with different metals. And then it has these little, um, almost like stone beads, I would say, that almost have a tie dye finish to them. And there's blue orange and brown of those. But the vibration sounds through the metal might be kind of nice.
<laughs> All right. So those are the random few things that I just happened to grab around um, outside. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I'm interested to see how it turns out just because of the additional noises um, that the mic probably picked up. So... Um, I obviously will be watching through this and editing out any extremely loud noises because that would defeat the purpose of this video. So, um, yeah. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye!